Welcome to this inspiring DIY video where I take an old and intricate wooden wall coat rack and give it new life with the magic of any Sloan chalk paint. Today we will embark on a journey of creativity, exploring the art of layering and the unique techniques that will turn this antique piece into a masterpiece of vintage charm. Our project begins with an elegant wooden wall coat rack adorned with exquisite wood carvings, showcasing the timeless beauty of traditional craftsmanship. To capture the essence of antiquity, I have chosen Annie Sloan chalk paint in the shade Graphite as my base color. Graphite's rich and deep tone provides the perfect foundation for the layering process. I randomly apply the graphite chalk paint to the surface, with brush strokes going every direction. This is the first step in creating depth and character to the piece. The can of paint I am using is rather old, so the paint has dried out a bit over time. And although dried out paint usually isn't something you'd like to use, in this case it's just perfect since this will help me add more texture, which is exactly what I want for this piece. I have to admit, not all the texture I created was to my liking, so I scuff sanded the whole piece between layers. To achieve the layered effect, I'll be using the heavy dry brushing technique with Annie Sloan's Country Grey. This technique involves taking a minimal amount of paint on a brush, wiping off most of it on a piece of cardboard and then lightly brushing it to the surface. By doing this, I only deposit a subtle amount of paint, highlighting the raised portions of the wood carvings while leaving the recesses in shadow. The contrast is already starting to show, but remember, it's all about trusting the process. After the first layer of country grey dries, it is time to accentuate the calf details using graphite once more. This step might seem counterintuitive, as it may not look great at this stage. But remember, we are building layers to create depth and character. The reason I am adding this step is to reinforce those deeper details with the dark color chalk paint once again. Patience and perseverance are key when aiming for a beautifully layered finish. Now that we've reintroduced graphite, let's return to the country grey. By layering these shades, I am enhancing the dimensionality and visual interest of the piece. The more layers we add, the more captivating the final result will be. My next step is the light dry brushing technique using Annie Sloan's Old White. This technique follows a similar process as before, but with an even lighter touch, allowing just a whisper of white to highlight certain areas. This gentle touch of light adds a touch of weathered grays to the coat rack, lending it that charming vintage appeal we desire. Before 
before we move on, let's protect and enrich the paint with clear wax. Applying the wax in a circular motion helps seal the paint and gives it a velvety finish. Now I am going to add an exquisite touch by applying Poshchalk Black Patina to the intricate wood carvings. This dark lace will settle into the recesses accentuating the intricate details and providing a sense of age and history. This step is where the details of the coat rack truly shine, creating a sense of history and character. shot you can see the subtle difference in the left part where the black patina has been added and the right part where I've only used clear wax. Finally to soften the overall look and create a gentle aged effect I apply a delicate touch of white wax. This will blend the layers together harmoniously giving the coat rack a beautifully time-worn appearance. And there you have it, a stunning transformation of an old wall coat rack into a masterpiece of layered elegance. Let's have a quick look at how this coat rack used to look like. And here is how it looks now. The play of shadows and highlights achieved through the layering techniques with any slow chalk paint has given this piece a sense of history and allure. Remember, when experimenting with layering and chalk paint, embrace the imperfections, as they add character and uniqueness to each creation. There is no right or wrong way to do it, it's all about exploring your creativity and finding joy in the process. The beauty of this technique lies in the patience and layers we build, creating a truly unique and one-of-a-kind piece. Thank you so much for joining me on this artistic adventure. I hope you've been inspired to explore the world of chalk paint and create your own layers of history on treasured pieces. Don't forget to like, subscribe and share this video with fellow DIY enthusiasts. I hope to see you again next time. Bye!